A lot of people have been complaining about the mosquito problem here in the valley, and we have covered a number of stories on it. I'm Joe Muller in the East Valley. Today we are taking a look at Clark County's new tool, a drone that will help with the problem. It's our new drone. It's for our insect suppression program. So this is actually a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Uh, yeah. I was expecting one of those small ones you do, uh, you can buy yeah. at the store, but this is pretty big. Yeah. Um, it has a granular or dry application tank, and there's we have a liquid one as well. Check out Clark County Vector Control's new tool, this drone called RC1. Basically, you'll fly it and it'll spray out the stuff. Pilot Nathaniel Crost is an officer at Clark County Vector Control. So you can tell it where it's going to launch. He flies the drone to drop pesticides on weeds and waterborne insects, like black flies and mosquitoes in county bodies of water, such as this channel in the East Valley. What's wild is this map on here. I mean, it looks like you're on Google Maps. Or something. It pretty, pretty much, the Google Maps is the base form of it. It costs about $68,000. The drone's main pop focus is going to be on our black fly program that we have down in Laughlin, but we'll be able to use it in the mosquito abatement program. Supervisor Christopher Bramley has been with the vector control for decades. With the advent of this invasive 80s mosquito, that's where you know all of these complaints are now coming from. So that has been the uptick that we've dealt with. A lot of you posted on social media wondering why we have so many mosquitoes. So I did some digging and found the 80s Egypti mosquito first popped up in southern Nevada in 2017. In the past few years, the population exploded. And this season, folks are feeling the bite. It's different than other mosquitoes as it only takes a bottle cap of water to breed. These mosquitoes don't need a whole lot of water. So a broken sprinkler head, a valve box that's leaking and holding enough water. We need to educate the public. Similar drones are used in northern Nevada, but this is the first for Clark County. Vector Control says the county is working to fight the bite, but property owners also need to do their part by getting rid of any standing water on your property. It's a great piece of equipment. And Clark County says you can call them with any questions you might have when it comes to mosquitoes. We have their contact information up on our website, ktnv.com. Reporting in the East Valley, I'm Joe Moeller.